I'm afraid at least 40 people are feared dead as a bus carrying 49 passengers caught fire in Mehboob Nagar near Hyderabad early this morning. Now the fuel tank of the bus reportedly burst which led to the fire. The bus was uh, trying to uh, overtake another vehicle when its diesel tank hit a culvert. According to sources, the incident took place at around 5.20 in the morning when most of the passengers were asleep. Uma Sudhir joins us on the phone line for more. Uh, Uma, it was an AC uh, Volvo bus uh, and of course uh, it has uh, those windows that it takes time, that don't open and uh, tragedy really uh, uh, taking place. 40 passengers feared dead. Yes, Gargi, I in fact have the uh, official uh, list of the reserved uh, uh, passengers who were on that particular bus. Many of them very, very uh, young people in their 20s and their 30s and uh, the reserved uh, the list has about mentions about 33 people but as is the practice uh, there uh, appear to have been other passengers who got on to the bus uh, uh, en route after the reserve passengers had already boarded the bus what we uh, understand is that the driver and the cleaner uh, and five other people we are being told now that have managed to get out of that bus the driver seems to have told the police uh, this is from our sources that uh, the one of the front tires in fact burst and that's the reason why the bus kit and the diesel tank hit a culvert and then the bus burst into flames. As you mentioned, this was an air-conditioned bus and it, there was really no escape for those passengers trapped inside. Most of them would have been in deep sleep very early hours. We are talking about around 5 in the morning the, in Mehboob Nagar, uh, Kotakota uh, area, on the Palam village of Mehboob Nagar district, which will uh, be about 150 kilometers uh, from Hyderabad. Uh, we were just a short while ago at the Hyderabad office of Jabba Travels. Uh, the bus to belong to this particular travel service that uh, flies between Bangalore and Hyderabad and uh, several relatives in fact are gathered there. The office had not opened presumably because of the, the kind of tensions that would prevail there, the anger among the people as well, huge police deployment as well outside there and we met at least uh, two people who were uh, looking for, uh, uh, you know, people who are being told that they were boarding a particular bus, but their name is not on the reserve list. So very, very concerned uh, uh, relatives in grief, in shock, and hoping really for the best because there has been no way of confirming uh, who really was on that bus and who was not. The only basis on which they can uh, uh, go is the list that they have of the reserve uh, passengers on that particular bus and many hoping that their uh, their loved ones were not really traveling on that bus. As you mentioned again, festival season coming up and that's the reason why uh, the bus we presume may have been uh, more full than usual as well. All right, uh, Uma, thanks so much for joining us uh, with that. So tragedy early this morning with that bus catching fire uh, and dozens of people feared dead.